I think when we ponder the place, the role of the Holy Spirit in the life of the church, that one of the dramas, one of the issues of why we don't see the Holy Spirit at work within the church is what you've just been sharing about. It's until we get to that point that we are so desperate, so in need, we're so wounded and hurting that we realize there is no space, there is no capacity, there is nothing that I can do that will solve this, that will provide any kind of answer. And so there's this space, this capacity for God to work. But when we're self-sufficient and when we've got everything together and when we feel like we can do it ourselves and unfortunately for so much of the history of our church, that's exactly where we thought we were. We thought we've got it all sorted, we've got it all sweet and there's not the space for the Holy Spirit to do that work. And as I was kind of pondering of this space between the Ascension and the Pentecost, and it kind of feels like it's, it's more than just the 10 days that Luke tells us in the Acts of the Apostles, because there's so much there that is preparing the ground for that woundedness, for the emptiness, for the space that God can fill.